Oh. <laughs> well, well, well. Welcome to the DMV Department of Motor Vehicles. How may I help you today? Oh. <laughs> yes, yes, you may recognize me as um, a very famous person called say this with a straight face. Give me one moment, please. I, oh, I know you have to get back to work. I know you're probably taking a lunch break to get this done. But shh, hold on. <clears throat> okay. Oh. Working at the DMV simply dehydrates my body. single one of the industry so well no 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 I, I I've never even heard of those people but I will gladly help you renew your license here at the DMV as fast as humanly possible if my name isn't Dr. Nermes These are little pretzel balls. They're delicious. I just find them to be very conveniently held in this container. Sir or madam. Sir or madam. I can't hear you right now. Yes, I know. since now that I know you're with people like um, you know, Tingle Bottom Industries I'm gonna well, 
Oh, no, no, I've never heard of them before. Any of <laughs> what? I don't even know who they are, I told you that. But, I mean, you know, by looking at the... original license before I can go just granting you a new one. I like the way that's worded. Before I can grant you the license to operate a motor vehicle in our state. Okay, so let me see. Generally, we do a density test. Wait a minute, what? Dang it all. Dang it all. The heck, what was the procedure? Systems are down for manual testing of authenticity of driver's licenses. I don't think there's a density. Yeah. <laughs> 
issue you a fake ID citation. Don't worry, first I'm going to issue the citation, then I'm going to look up the ID in our manual database.
what the sort of 23 point man? What, what, what's that? Sir or madam, do not speak to me like that again. I am a doctor. Okay, yes, yes, this is a tool catalog. I'm sorry, that's, I'm sorry. You got me. Please. I beg you on bended knee not to tell my employee. <laughs> like they would ever fire somebody from the DMV. <laughs> no, that's cute. That's cute. No, no, no. I'm just kidding. Yeah, no, I, I kind of feel like this maybe probably isn't fake, so I'm going to retract the citation for.
No, I, I really was. Like, I think it's Led Zeppelin. Yeah, the second album, I don't know which, you know, just singing. Immigrant song, the peasant song, I forget the title. It's, you know. What difference does it make? What difference does it make? Okay. Listen, my lunch break is about to start, so we gotta hurry this up. So please, can you stop interrupting me? Now, let me get our license logging book. If you just answered me the first time, I wouldn't have to have cussed, would I? Barbara. Barbara, can you please stop wearing that horrid perfume? No. <laughs> Believe me. It does you no justice. It's giving me a migraine. Well, Barbara, well, that's not my fault that you smell like a French toaster. <laughs> to I said toaster. I said toaster. You know, toaster, you put a piece of bread in your breast. Oh, Barbara, get a grip. You're so rude. You're like the I hate working with you, Barbara. You're so rude. Hey, Barbara, why don't you learn? some social skills. What do you think about that? I don't care what you tell John. Oh, you have no idea, sir and or madam. Barbara is like <laughs> the worst. I mean, Barbara, I'm talking to a customer. Please be professional. She just sit do you see do you hear her? Listen to her squelching away over there. It's like I don't know, it's like it's like if you took a rooster. 
Twitter and you combined it with a crow and then you squished it in a wine press. That's what Barbara sounds like on her best day and it's really depressing. My job here at the DMV would be so much more enjoyable were it not for Barbara in her job. Barbara, I can call John Bald because I'm going to be bald someday, probably in like another 40 years. I know, I got a beautiful full head of hair, even at my age. I know that, Barbara, but that's not my fault, is it, Barbara? Is that my fault? Barbara, you stink. Stop wearing that perfume or I'm going to lodge a complaint. Well, don't think I won't. I think I won't. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, please. Allow me to pick your license up off the filthy DMV floor. Where God knows what's going on there. <laughs> and then we're going to get you out of here. In one shake of a raccoon's schnitzel. Oh. Alright, let's just... Listen, we're almost done.
just, you know, just have John do it. It's not. This is nothing to do with you, I promise, Sir and or Matt. I promise. Just let me just finish. I'll have you out of here in two shakes of a leprechaun. Leprechaun's right finger. Pinky finger. Two shakes of a leprechaun's right pinky finger. Is that how it goes? Two sh I'll have you out of here in two shakes.
right here in the employee handbook. Where is it? Page. Yeah, here we go. Mr. or Mrs. Know-it-all. All driver's licenses that are being dispensed out to the peasant public. No, I, it doesn't say peasant, but I like that word too. So just peasant public. Must be an A official. That's the key. Official. Official. State sponsored. Expensive. Sealed. Plastic. Containment. Vessel. Okay. So before you go yapping off, telling me how to do my part time job temporarily here at the Sir and or madam, I would like to thank you on behalf of the Department of Motor Vehicles for being patient. As you can see, we have, after, what, like, 60 years, we have got this down to a science. We get the people in, and then we get the people out. Yes, yes, yeah, we, we, we see the public. Oh yeah. 
Oh, she's, 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 sorry, she's, she's, you know, one of them, there's one in every office, am I right? Here is your license. Oh, gee, that was, sir and or madam, that was completely unnecessary, you didn't snatch it out of my hand like that. That was rude. How rude. Oh, oh look at that. Nope, so, oh, I'm sorry, you've been standing in line for like six hours. I'm about to go on lunch. Barbara, 